Hello and welcome back to our X4 Foundations Let's Play Poorly. So we are here to deliver this ship, which is uh, which we're kind of slightly agglomerated to at the moment. Let's get out of there. That was a little weird. All right, there he goes. Now we need to fly to Windfall. He's gonna we're delivering that ship over to Windfall. Which is not very far, so. So that is the ship that we had just boarded as part of the uh, Imperian Kerr mission, uh, uh, mission chain. Uh, for some reason, there's still a boarding pod out here. He's gonna die a slow death. Uh, let's go ahead and autopilot that. Let's look at Drill Monk. Okay, Drill Monk has done some things here. What has Drill Monk done? Okay, dropped a resource probe. Can we get him to do anything interesting over here? What do we got? We got some Nvidium. We do have Nvidium. Okay. Just a slight amount. Well, okay. Well, let let's let's do it. Let's uh Let's get him to mine some of that. Nope, that's silicon, or in silicon, or in silicon. Oh no, there's just just nothing here, is there? Entering All right. System. In that case, then, fine goods needs what? What do they do? We don't even know. Okay. I think refined goods is silicon, but I could be wrong about that. Maybe not. Anyway. What we're going to do instead with this Drill Monk guy is we're going to go ahead and disengaged. set you to do some local auto mining. Have you grab some silicon. And then just see what happens. Why not? Sacrificial Chipmunk will be ready shortly to go and sacrifice itself in, where is it, Grand Exchange 1. Alright, so we need to go, ooh, there's a silicon refinery here. We're going to go ahead and just dock and wait you over there. Because you did pick up the antimatter cells. Yes. Okay. And now here's second chance. Alright, so second chance we need to deliver the boarded ship. Here it comes. Once it gets into the ring, into the bubble, then, uh, It'll ask us if we want to deliver, and we'll say yes. But we just gotta wait for a bit. Oh, come on. How are you how are your butt up, man? Does he not want to come? Come on. Get your butt in gear. Are you even moving? Pelican Vanguard. Very, very slowly. All right. So it goes. All right, Callisto Chipmunk, what you doing? Okay, you're doing your... Uh, Space fuel. Okay, you're you're doing your um, exploration. Scout one. Also doing that. So you know what I've been thinking. I wonder if maybe it would be a good idea to have myself a depot station, a mining depot station somewhere. I know I can get Nvidium down here. I mean, I wouldn't do it for that. Wouldn't be for the depot station. I was just thinking of two things at once, really. I don't really have enough money for that. I will need a bigger storage, so I'd have to wait till I can buy that. Uh, yeah, that that'll be that'll be rough. Okay. We'll think about that going forward. All right. Well, we 
we've, we've gotten, we've arrived. Now we just need to wait for Ace. My ship is being scanned. Awaiting orders. Uh, comply? Right? You don't have anything weird on you, do you? Oh, you do. Crap. Well, hopefully none of that's illegal. You might have to drop a, drop a bunch of it. Oh, I think you probably did. Oh, no. No, you're good. All right. Do you want to hand it over now? Confirm. Yay, okay. Much appreciated. Alright, that is done. Let's see what's next. We still got some hop things we can do, right? Let's go set that one to active. Do we actually have a satellite now? Yes, we do. Alright. But it doesn't it doesn't say where we need to go. That's really interesting. Oh, it's because we've got to go... Full. Okay, where where is that? Open the briefing. Hmm. Doesn't actually say. Deep scan the ship on our behalf. This is very weird, because we're going to a laser tower... You know what? We may have to dump that one. Now, oh, here all we go. Current preparation complete. Everything taking shape. Return to receive instructions on how to continue. All right. Well, we'll come back to you later. We'll come back to you later. We're gonna get ourselves a reward, but we'll we'll leave that for the cliffhanger. I think it's about time to do this. Autopilot engaged. Yeah, so we're gonna go. Yeah, use this time to find other missions. Yeah, that's that's what this is. Uh, this th this uh, help text comes up whenever you uh, get to this point in the PhD. Entering mission. system 18 billion. All right, not too far to go. Where's sacrificial chipmunk? Slowly making our way over there too. Kinda wait it out. Alright, this guy is whipping around. Callisto Chipmunk, the thing is I, I really do want to put Chipmunk I want to subordinate Chipmunk to something, because it's just sitting there. I mean it, uh, it's it's a tr it's a Entering trading system. ship. Grand exchange. Right? It's a Callisto Sentinel. Uh it really shouldn't be doing scouting missions, or, you know, sc scouting tasks. But pretty soon I'll be able to make the dock. I'll be able to, once the, once that PHQ appears, I'll be able to do the dock, and that will allow me to use the Callisto for some of that delivery. Though it's a very tiny ship, so I don't know how useful that's going to be in the long run, but it may end up ultimately just being worthwhile to sell it. And pick up some more miners, get some, get that mining depot that I want down the road. Or maybe I won't go that route. I mean, I do already have a mining depot in the, uh, the fully modded save, which uh, I started with, which I should be able to, I'm going to, I might go back to it soon. 
Uh, I know all of those mods are pretty much working just fine. I tested it out a little bit. The space trucking um, the series is going back, you know, it's back on uh, back on the menu. So I think our primary one, uh, the modded primary modded one, should be should be ready to go. And it'll be nice to be able to flip, finish those split missions finally, because I did confirm that that is working now. They must have fixed something in 5.0 that made those pop up. That, that, that was that incoming message that I got stuck on. And it's working. The autopilot is about to blast me into this asteroid, though. That's that's a problem. Let's, uh, let's autopilot. turn off the autopilot. Disengage. Ooh, that was close. Entering Grand Exchange One. Okay, so we're nearly there. We've got our sacrificial chipmunk is here. And let's send you to the right spot. And we're gonna approach as well. We found something out here. Who did? Oh, let's collect it. Click that lockbox. All right. Here it comes. Awaiting orders. Oh Mission no, you're going to die, aren't you? It is far too early in this experiment for needless casualties. All right, let's get you out of there. Can I get you on to me? Yes, okay. Right? Excellent. Very good. We seem to be ready for the initial test. I would advise that you clear the area as there are a number of unknowns. Fly to the following position. All right. So, I often tell tell people who ask about this game uh about, I tell them, you know, you, you, it's really a good idea to play with a HODES if you've got one, with throttle and stick, gamepad, whatever. Uh, a lot of people say, you know, I prefer the mouse, blah, 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 because of the map, because you're constantly having to be in the map all the time. And so what's the point of having, you know, uh, a device when all you're going to be doing is in the map, being in the map all the time? Well, first of all, you don't have to have just one device, right? You could have your stick and your throttle and a mouse and use your mouse on the map. Um, but one of the things that people always point out, which is relatively valid, is that you, towards the mid and the late game, you end up spending almost all your time in the map. So what is the, even the point? Um, well, one of the things that I've noticed that I do a lot is I pop to the map when I'm trying to just figure out where I am in space. And on the one hand, yay, there's a map and it helps me figure out where I am. But I do have a radar. And... There's really no reason I can't just be using my radar all the time for close by stuff. Successfully interfaced with the ship. I am increasing the output of the power plant while reducing the shielding of the antimatter containers to see if that affects the anomaly. So my point is I'm going to try to use my radar a lot more in terms of orienting Wonderful. myself. We are getting a reaction. The ship is beginning to show strain, but I will continue to push it further. Keep your distance. You bet. The tear is expanding. It's about to reach the ship. The antimatter will most likely detonate. Boom. And there's the PHQ. Yay! Okay. Ugh, that thing always looks so cool. Ooh! Ooh, that hit me with a blast wave. 
What is this? Some large artificial structure. So this is what was on the other side of the tear. It does seem that our investigation has led to some potentially groundbreaking discovery. Now, my friend, this is where we must proceed with both haste, haste and caution. <laughs> While I admit, tearing free space-time with an antimatter explosion was far from restrained, we now have something in front of us of untold scientific value. We would be fools to continue carelessly. For the benefit of the universe, let us hurry and claim our prize before someone can beat us to I'll be damned if some passing Taladi junk dealer decides to break it down for spare parts. Or worse yet, the Ministry of Finance Science Division. I will begin to interface with the structure remotely. Do you mind flying around it so I can make some additional readings? No, let's do it. Let's start over here. are not quite as alien as I would have expected from such an object. Could this be a top secret installation? They are in fact Terran. Oh my. I do hope we <laughs> haven't hijacked some distant Terran station. Which is exactly what we've done. Which is interesting because of course we didn't know that back in 2018. That line of dialogue was in there the whole time. So they clearly had something planned. Um, I mean, I would expect them to. I mean, they're designing a long-term game. Uh, but yeah, it's fun. It's fun that uh, that information got given to us piecemeal. It does seem somewhat unfinished, and the materials it is constructed of are quite strange. Even the computer pathways I am navigating are unconventional. Also, there's a big, enormous rock in the middle of it. Build a dock. Let's build ourselves a basic dock. Where are we going to put you? Uh, we got these connection points, so we're. Uh, it doesn't really matter too much. We'll just stick it right here. I wanted to put it on the prettiest part. Is that pretty part? Is that a pretty part right over here? I think so. Oh, oh. Oh, right. There's that weird bug, isn't it? Ah, uh, well, I've forgotten now what I need to do to fix that. Uh, there is a weird bug in version 5 right now where you have to... You can't... Do the... You can't build the first piece in the dock for some reason. I think I have to go here and buy a blueprint like a fake blueprint kind of thing it's like a glitch of some sort but we're gonna go try that out and see if that's what it is if i'm remembering that right um if not we'll we'll pass on and do other things i don't know how much time we have left it's been 20 minutes so we've only got another 10 minutes in this episode but i should be able to read up it's a it's a known documented glitch so 
Uh, hopefully it'll get resolved soon, but um, at the moment uh, it does require like a, a workaround step. And I think the workaround step is to buy a zero credit blueprint from someone from you know from a uh, a faction that you can buy blueprints from you have to buy any blueprint that costs money but then you can also get the zero credit one Entering I think but there might also be another fix four. for that now but we're not in any hurry it's just the PHQ Meanwhile, let's see what our other guys are doing. Drill Monk, what are you up to? No buyers are in this sector, but we are at full silicon. Okay. So, let's oh, turn on off, turn on that, and let's see who's buying silicon. Someone down here. Anybody else? All right, let's do that then. There we go. So we're going to execute that trade, and then he'll just come right back up here and get more silicon. Because the the base default behavior is the local auto mine in Hatikva's Choice. We can override it temporarily if we can't if they can't find a local uh, sell point. So it's not the end of the world. It just, uh, you know, adds a step. This is a tag a ship. Nah. How's this guy doing? Very slowly going about. Very slowly going about. Let's see where else they can eventually go. Maybe they need to go down to Profit Center Alpha. Have them explore over there. And then explore in Bright Promise. And this guy should probably explore in there. Takes a minute to get to the to the highway ring that we need to get to, which is all the way up here. Entering system eighteen billion. Ah, deliver some sand filters. Do I even have sand filters? I don't think I do. No. But I might someday. Whoops, I forgot. Uh, wait, who am I with? How am I with ministry? Minus four. No, we want Argon. Engaged. It's just a pity it's that far away. But that is where the uh, the faction rep is. That's what that little uh, the little essentially it's like a queen chess piece kind of thing going on there. See, I keep having this habit of going onto the map even though I don't really need to. Uh, although, honestly, it's a little bit more dynamic than just sitting and watching autopilot, so... Where are you? Okay, yeah, you're making your way down to where you're gonna sell, which is over here. Okay. Oh, we need some people to come into Black Hole Entering Sun system. and investigate that, Silent too. Witness. there. Yeah, 
Ah, oh, these fuzzy rocks. I really don't like the fuzzy rocks in the uh, in Silent Witness. They they make me feel things that I don't like. Ah, oh, they feel so so weird. Look like weird hairy spaghetti balls. I don't know. Maybe it's because this whole zone is purple and they're slightly purple. Whatever it is, it's just I don't I don't like looking at them. <laughs> Entering system. I take class choice. This is a much prettier sector. Entering system, Argon Prime. Autopilot, disengage. Docking granted. Illegal data. Short oh. range transporter, A. Fine. We're pleased to welcome you aboard. We can find this person. Yeah, rep's office. Ah, oh, I forgot. This is so cool. So the new aquarium thingy. Love it. All right, we need to talk to Thanks you. For your oh, somebody. Ha oh yeah, because we. Uh... Ooh, we made Hello. some money. Okay, drill monk. Yeah, so Drill Monk's gonna get back up and go up back to where they were mining. So, okay. It's good to see you, friend. Let's buy a blueprint. I hope this is the right way to do it. Uh, was it dock modules? It says it's owned. Is it something else? No. Okay, so it's probably not something like that then. Good luck well, out there. No worries. We will uh, I will figure out the solution. Ah, look at you. Let me just try it one last time here. Maybe something shook First, itself out. Place a new dock module. You can put it wherever you desire. Okay. I would award you imaginary star points for attaching it to the structure. This is new. But you are, of course, Never said that free before. to express your artistic virtuosity. Oh. Once you are satisfied with the placement, huh. confirm your changes. It must have required a bit of a delay of some sort to for that for him to be able to start talking. So, all right. Well, we're actually going to put you over here because you're more fun over there. I don't know. Right, is that more fun? Yeah, I think that's more fun. Now, allocate sufficient credits to the construction site. I recommend accepting the estimated construction budget. So this is all new dialogue. I like it. you need to hire a builder. Notice how your map interface is automatically filtering for the there correct ship type. Look at that. If you expand the scope of your map, you may be able to spot one of these contractors just wandering about. Yeah. If you have no luck, consider deploying more satellites. There Provided you that you have allocated sufficient funds to the construction site, other traders will now begin to deliver the required materials. You can observe the containers being stockpiled at the build storage. 
a small temporary structure on the outskirts of the station build plot. Okay, so here's what we need. Claytronics, which there's already an order in place, 101 energy cells and 185 hull parts. So with those energy cells, I should be able to use Callisto. Uh, I've been already setting up things. I don't need to do that now. Let's go ahead and hold position on you there. Oh, what am I doing? We need 101 energy cells. If you bring any creatures on board, please make sure they are chained. Any loose animals will be vaporized on site. Hundred one, and then transfer build storage. Done. So we'll start with that, and then when we get back next time, we will continue with that and try some other hey, join a war effort and so on and so forth. Anyway, that'll do it for me right now. Thanks for watching. See you next time.